SRTV News. I'm your host, Louis Mann. The headlines tonight. Daily runs a ton. Shelford's community kit going to the vote. Hoodlums hit height barrier. Andrew Daly ran 100 kilometres over the weekend, raising money for the Wooden Spoon charity. He raised over £2,000. In a statement, Mr Daly said, I'm knackered and my legs no longer work. Interesting stuff. A number of entries were received for the Shelford Community Kit competition. The entries will be voted on by club members and the winning entry will be realised, worn on Community Day and auctioned off. All proceeds going to the NHS. Not long after being repaired, somebody has hit our height barrier once again, uh, bending it towards the club. Club officials are asking anybody with any information to come forward. Now on to local sports, our reporter Louis Mann has more. Yeah, thanks Louis, and of course we're all anxiously awaiting sport that isn't something pointless like the Bundesliga. Uh, we're all we're following the government, uh, the RFU's announcements, following the government uh, guidelines. So all very excited to see that we can now train in groups of six with a ball, and parents can drop off their children. Uh, we'll see how that develops. In other news, the uh, Shelford Rugby Women's Team have announced that coming soon will be their boot camps pending government guidelines. So we're very much looking forward to that. And finally, I've got the results of this week's Guess the Player competition. From top to bottom, we have Nathan Taylor and Abby McMillan-Jones. In the middle, we've got Jessica Norris and Lewis Cracknell. And at the bottom, we've got Ollie Jury and his moustache and Chloe Housden. Cheers, Louis. Back to you. Thanks for that, Louis. Interesting stuff. Uh, now onto the weather. Our weatherman, Louis Mann, has more. Thanks, Louis. Uh, forgive the green screen, but our graphics team have been put on furlough, along with our meteorologist. So, uh, looking outside of the, uh, the weather today, it, it looks pretty grim. Uh, but if, if we imagine that this is kind of the Cambridge area, and in a southerly direction we have, we have the village of Shelford, well, we know the sun always shines there. Thanks for that, Louis. And now a special report on birthdays. Yes, thank you, Louis. And of course, we've got a few special birthdays coming up this week. So we just wanted to wish a very special Peacock Happy Birthday to Jill Clark, Alan Hills, Damon Astin, Keith Boyle, Rachel Myers, Chloe Barker, Tui, son of Solo, Dexter Med, Richard Kahn, Leslie Sonnen, Felix Chater, and Alistair Christie. And of course, a special thank, uh, happy birthday to Harvey Taylor, who sent us in this drawing of a birthday cake. Happy 15th birthday, Harvey. And uh, another special birthday goes to Steve Cracknell, um, who sent us this lovely drawing of himself as a superhero. And here we have his wife, Wendy, son, Lewis, and daughter, Alex. So happy birthday to you, Steve. Over to you, Louis. Thank you, Louis. So that's all from us tonight. Uh, thank you for tuning in to SRTV News. Stay alert and we'll see you soon. Thank you.